Do you remember the circumstances of the uh, the cop coming to talk to the audience during Green Day? Oh, I oh my God! Can, can you talk about that? Yeah, all? that was actually the hired security officer that was mandated by Nordic Hall that I had to pay. Grumpy old man, and again, I, I I'm embarrassed when I watch that video how I yell at the crowd. <laughs> I watch that to these days, I'm like, oh my God. But what people kind of didn't know under the covers is that this security guy, like if he wanted to shut the show down, the Nordic Hall staff gave him full authority to, if he thought things were going south or things weren't coming, going the way they should, he could shut it down. And so when this guy's up here yelling at the crowd and the kids are getting more mouthy and aggro with him, I knew what could come. Like that he could just say, oh, pull the plug, that's it. And um, it's hard to explain that to a total, to a 300 kids. Yeah. Um, but what had happened, the reason that guy even got on stage is because there was some drinking in the parking lot and some littering and little things that happen when you get 300 kids together. Um, and this probably sounds bad, like, as far as like drinking at these shows was so minimal like honestly for what would probably happen these days but he had gotten in a tiff with some kids drinking in the parking lot and was going to shut the show down and he literally just came down to kind of tell people like hey and he's you know of course he's grumpy old man that's indecipherable when he talks and I kind of had to take charge of the situation and yell at the crowd and say, hey, there's not going to be any more shows if you don't listen to this guy. That doesn't mean I agree with him. That doesn't mean I like it. But I'm also the guy that's paying everybody and everything's in my name. And if Green Day, you know, because at the time, Green Day for that particular run had drove just to play Sioux Falls, Mankato and Milwaukee. That's it. And then they were going to drive back. So the fact that they could not play after driving 27 hours was unacceptable to me, regardless of the circumstance. So, but to this day, I watch that video and I just like, I'm like, oh my God, and I think that I would think I was 16 at the time.